Parents often warn their kids that they will go deaf if they don't turn down the music, even when wearing earbuds. But they usually don't listen. Now, a new University of Florida study warns that an alarming number of college students are actually beginning to lose their hearing. While testing students who thought they had normal hearing, researchers discovered 25% of them actually lost some of their hearing. Male college students who reported using portable music players were more likely to have hearing loss in the high frequency range. Researchers say the hearing loss detected in the students usually occurs in older adults. So the, the level of hearing loss that we are seeing, it's starting at the higher frequencies and that's exactly what you see in an aged ear. So typically starting around 50, you'll start to see hearing losses in the higher frequencies. When we're seeing kids who already have those kinds of hearing losses, it's very alarming. A 15 decibels or more deficit in hearing was detected in the students in the study with hearing loss. Researchers say this amount of hearing loss does not require a hearing aid, but it could be disrupted to education. That level of hearing loss could lead to problems in the classroom. So for example, someone who has a 15 dB level of hearing loss might have a harder time understanding what the teacher is saying, or if there's noise in the classroom, if other students are talking and there's competing signals, it could be more challenging for that student to understand the material being presented. Researchers say current hearing tests in school children are not detecting a lot of hearing loss because the screenings check a narrow frequency range. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilowich.